All right, everybody, welcome to the SSN Nation Wednesday night live stream where members only with the icon can be here in the chat room. And tonight, how to achieve financial freedom in 2023. If you can't get in the chat room, that's because you don't have the icon. That means you're not a member of the channel. You cannot be a, just a subscriber in order to be in the chat room, but everybody can watch and welcome. Stop struggling now, gear. Check and please like, subscribe, and click the bell below so you get the latest updates. Now, let's get to it. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. And once again, please share the videos. In fact, grab a few people and say, hey, you might want to come check out these live streams on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday nights because you never know what information you're going to be able to get. So let's start this off first, ladies and gentlemen. Please let me know if you received the YouTube notification and if you saw the trailer. That would be greatly appreciated. Now, let's get into tonight and see who's in the house. Laverne Penix is here. Welcome to the SSN Nation Wednesday night live stream, otherwise known as Wealthy Wednesdays. And he has the icon next to his name. That's the only way he can be in the chat room. Thank you so much for your support financially, Laverne Penix. And he's known as Mr. Cool in these parts. And he brings his tagline, hey, SSN Nation, I hope all is well. Tesla is in the buy zone. I have to agree. Remember, I was like 140 and below, but little did I know it could be at 110, 112. Yes, it is in the buy zone for sure. I have to admit, we don't know where the bottom is, but you have to start thinking somewhere around this area, it should be 100, 110. It dropped even down, I believe, as low as 102. It popped back up. We're going to talk about that because this is how you achieve financial freedom, ladies and gentlemen. You make sure that you are in equities, otherwise known as stocks. That's what you need to be in right now. If you knew the stock market, some stocks have dropped 60, 70, 80 percent. And these are big time companies just like Tesla. Is this a good time to buy is the million dollar question. Hell yes, it's a good time to buy. I don't care if you bought it 120, 115, 110, 102. It might drop to 95 for all we know. We'll get a earnings report, I believe, in the next seven to 10 days. So now it could fluctuate either up or down. But I agree with Mr. Cool on this. 110, that's definitely in a buy zone. All right, let's see who else is here because we got to achieve this financial freedom for 2023. We have to have a game plan, which we do. And Victor Marrero is here. Welcome to the SSN Nation Wednesday night live stream, otherwise known as the Wealthy Wednesday night live stream. He has the icon. So thank you so much for your support financially as well, Victor Marrero. And he brings one of two taglines. He says, hello all. Let's do this. And that's what we're going to do. We're coming with the pain. It's going to take hard work, ladies and gentlemen. Like if you want to start your own business, you guys know the link is down below. I suggest you start your own business out of your home. Use a virtual office. A virtual office that actually answers the phone in your company name is big time. The virtual office that answers the phone in your name and will transfer it to you. So they have live operators answering in your company name transfer it to you all at no additional cost they only have one cost per month or you can pay a year in advance and get a discount if you prefer but the next thing is they give you a business number 
that's in 411. They give you a business fax number. They report to the credit bureau for your business every month. That's just for starters. There's an actual commercial address that our offices. So if you ever had somebody come into town, you can actually get an office, rent an office for the hour or the boardroom. Big time benefits without having your address and possibly having people come to your home, knock on your doors, and you never know what else people do these days. So all I'm saying is it's a layer of security for you and your family as well, because your business is also separate. No reason to think about commingling. It's all separate address, separate everything. So it's clear cut. And so I recommend Opus Virtual Office. The link is down below because next year, buy a business, start a business is also in the top five list of what you should be doing for 2023 if you haven't already. Because in 2023, it's buy a home in about seven months, ladies and gentlemen. It starts to get into the buy zone after another seven, eight months from now and throughout the first quarter, first half of 2024. So are you going to be prepared? Well, now's the time to get ready. Laverne Pennick says he received the notification and the trailer. This is awesome. So let's get down to it. Before I go any further, there may be some people saying how to achieve financial freedom. And I did mention equities with your stocks, but just not any stocks. Think about dividend stocks. We've talked about this for the last four months and I've been giving out some and I'm just going to start off. Let's just go with L-U-M-N. I'm not even going to go look at it. You go look it up. Do your due diligence. L is in Larry. U is underwear. M is in Mary. N is in Nancy. You go look it up. You go tell me a 17%, 18% return every three months on the money that you put in is worth it. 17%, ladies and gentlemen, while you go to sleep, don't have to do anything else. Think about it. Not too shabby, is it? All right. That's just for starters. We're going to talk about a lot more than that. Victor Morell, yes, got the YouTube notification and trailer. That's two people. Yes, that is a good thing. Victor Morell points out that Tesla ended up at 112.71 on the positive side. This is awesome. But if you were in the market earlier today, it was below that. You could have bought it 108. 104, 107. So it's been in the buy zone today, but you would have had to be an active and know that. And Victor Morero says he was checking things out. Laverne Pennick says I was checking things out today. So today's in the buy zone. And again, I love it when a plan comes together because Laverne Pennix was sitting there saying, hey, I think I'm going to invest in some Tesla. I know he's been doing some DCA probably, but the point of the matter is, Anybody who did not buy in the 200s and who do not buy in the upper 100s, now you can buy two for the price of one is the way I look at it. Clearance sale right now. So if you would have bought at 250, clearly you got to buy at 112. That's two and a half for one. That's crazy. That's beautiful. Even I have to consider Tesla now because it's in the buy zone for me. I told you guys, once it goes down to under 140, now it was in the zone and I'm thinking, why buy, why bother? Let's see what happens. And I'm actually wanting to see what happens after another seven days from now or 10 days, whenever their earnings reports come out, they say they're going to miss, which may be the reason why it already dropped now. So you never know. So it could be they missed and people already are reacting to it. They're selling and it could also be the end of the year where people are taking their losses and counting it as a loss and then may rebuy back in uh, in about five or six days. So you never know what happens at the end of the year. There's reasons for everything. So we're going to talk about that. And another bloodbath at the start market. Where is the floor? Can someone see it? Definitely not for the faint of heart. Oh, it's okay, Victor Morrell. It's definitely not for the faint of heart. But here's the advantage. To achieve financial freedom, you have to believe that the stock market will go back up and history says ding 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 it's gonna go back up and because of the way our financial system is structured it will go back up sooner than the great depression it'll go back up faster so it won't take four years it won't take eight years it won't take ten years 
for it to go back up to achieve what you should be doing financially with the stock market. So once again, the bottom is near. I do believe that because it's going to coincide with the downside of housing as well. So I think the 70% 70 70 of stocks that have went down in value, the bottom has to be near. That's all I'm going to say. I cannot predict the, the bottom as well, but it has to be near, ladies and gentlemen, because this is clearance sale prices. Here's 70% off, 50% off. That's clearance prices. And these companies actually exist. They make a profit. We're talking about the likes of Apple and Facebook and Microsoft and Amazon and, and Tesla and all these guys who have advantages. They get subsidies. They get loans. They get free money damn near to actually try to create more money. So they have vehicles, plus they own other companies that have revenue. So there's no reason that 50% off, 60, 70% off, you should not be buying. Tesla 70 per, over 70% off, 71%, I believe I checked earlier today, year to date. That is incredible. All right. Now, let's see, bloodbath it is, not for the faint of heart, but hey, that's what you do. If you're an investor, you're the one that reaps the rewards. Remember, your financial freedom means you have to take risk. If you don't take any risk, you don't have financial freedom. What does risk look like? It's a simple thing. You have a job. You put your money in a 401k. That's a risk because you don't know what's going to happen. Just like when you have a job and they say they're going to pay you a pension. You don't know if that pension is going to be around 20 years from now to give you your retirement money. That's a risk. But if you want to be financially free, then you have to take risks. Like when I gave the LUMN at 17%, that's a risk. 17% return annually, dividend investing. And then I can say AGNC, A is in Apple, G is in George, N is in Nancy, C is in Charles. Think about these. I've talked about these for the last four months and beyond that. But the last four months, I've been talking about it because if you can get 14% return annually on whatever you put in now, what are you waiting for? Inflation could be 10 to 15% and you could beat inflation. And if they get inflation back under 5%, then you'll be in the catbird seat because if that company stays in business for the rest of your life, that's the return that you're going to be getting for money you put in today or tomorrow or next week, 14%, 17%, 18%, like ORC, for instance, Orchard Capital. Again, you guys already know who's been here, but all I'm saying is this is the point that you, this is the time. If you want financial freedom, you have to take risk. All right. That's how it goes. Victor Marrero, very good point. That's a good strategy. Selling and taking the big L. And claim it against your 2022 taxable income. That's it. I did that in 2021 and it worked out beautifully. Thanks for mentioning. Thank you so much, Victor Marrero. There you go, ladies and gentlemen. A testimonial that he's telling you. This actually did what the big boys do. But you're a big boy as well. Right? Again, you're the emerging millionaires in the house who watch these videos. Don't be shy, but you do have to take a risk with your hard-earned money. And I'm going to argue something while we go along this, how to achieve financial freedom in 2023. How about this, ladies and gentlemen? Make a commitment to yourself. Write down all the money that you're put, putting out that is just discretionary money. Some of you may go, hey, every Friday night, I do this. Every morning, I go to Starbucks. I know millions of people, that's their routine and pay eight to $15 or whatever it costs for Starbucks coffees or whatever. Um, how, how many times do I eat at lunch and go eat and get me that $15 lunch, right? How many times do I go out to the bar spending 50, 60, 100, 200, depends on who you are. Why don't you write all that down at the end of a year, put it under on a piece of paper, and then you're going to realize, wait a minute, I'm paying hundreds of dollars where I get no return. And when you start adding it up week after week, month after month, now all of a sudden you could have said, hey, I paid thousands of dollars for this over the year. 
and I could have actually had like $200, $300, $400 in my account. Maybe I need to achieve financial freedom a different way. You do have the money. You're just not allocating it into vehicles that give you a return on your investment. And one of the easiest ones is the stock market. So dividend investing, because those stocks went down 50% in some cases, that means the dividend is higher. So the LUMNs, the ORCs, the AGNCs, the REITs, for instance, which is a REIT, Real Estate Investment Trust. All these I've mentioned are Real Estate Investment Trust, except for Lumen. But we can go with IEP, which is Carl Icahn's, almost like his fund that crosses a large segment of the marketplace, meaning telecommunications, automotive, regular businesses. So he has a conglomerate. And again, 16% on your money, good enough? 18% annual return, good enough? Please tell me yes, because that's how you come financially free. 20 years from now, that investment turns into 20% annually. You're doubling your money every five years. But remember, it's compounding every three months. Because remember, part of your, if you're getting 17% return, that's almost 1.4, 1.45% monthly. So whatever you put in, that 1% can be reinvested. So it doesn't cost you anything additional. So you're actually compounding and turning it into more because once you get another share, you're going to add that. That adds up into additional dividend money coming in for the same money you spent. You get to win. You get to turn into Warren Buffett. 40 years later, if you live that long, right? But we're trying to do short term here, ladies and gentlemen. All right. So IEP, Carl Icahn. All right. Because I saw somebody, Curtis Davis mentioned it. Mr. Financial is here. All right, here he is. Welcome to the SSN Nation Wealthy Wednesday live stream. He has the icon next to his name. He's also known as Mr. Financial around here. And he brings his tagline. Good evening, SSN family. A-B-M-M. -M. If you're new here, you don't know what that means. Always be making money. That's what we try to do here while you're sleeping, ladies and gentlemen. That's what it means. And that's what we're trying to do. And also, Mr. Chili Davis. Chili Davis. Did you guys hear that? Chili Davis with two L's. Mr. Financial has his own YouTube channel. He gives out financial information throughout the day or evening. You never know when he's going to drop some gems. And he keeps you up to date on the stock market and equities and financial news. So he's a family member here with the SSN Nation. Go show some love. Subscribe to his channel. Click the all notification bell. The same thing hopefully you've done here. Do there and watch the gems being dropped. It doesn't stop. No person can give you gems for the whole entire marketplace. That's why you like to hear from people who just come with the information and say, hey, this is what happened today and gives you information. Then you can go do your own due diligence. Then they show you the ups and downs. Do your own due diligence if you want to get in. But I highly suggest you get some equities for 2023. If you want to achieve financial freedom, now's the time to take some of that money and put it into stocks. All right. And if you want free stocks, down below in the description, below the video, there's Robinhood and Weeble. There's promotions right now with Weeble where you can get more than two stocks. You can get five, you can get 10, you can get 12, depending on what you do, because you have to deposit, whether it's $1, you'll get like five shares. You'll get two just for downloading the Weeble app. So they have a promotion, holiday promotion. So get down with that. If you're unfamiliar with investing in stocks, there's always a good thing when you get free stocks, right? They may only be two or three or five, ten dollars, but you never know. Sometimes people get two hundred dollar stocks. Just depends. That's one in thousands, but nonetheless. All right. We are absolutely agree. You have to stay in the market. Keep adding. We've been down before and have always returned to the top. 
see it as an opportunity to build wealth. Exactly, Victor Morrell. Totally agree what you agree with and presenting it exactly how it should be thought of because opportunity to build wealth. I love that last little bit there. People, you don't understand what's happening. The greatest transfer of wealth is happening now. They messed up again. I've talked about this in the past. If you're new here, the top 10 percenters, the richest people on the planet, they mess up. Why? Because they're greedy. They don't work in the same ecosystem that we work in financially. Why? Because they can borrow money that we can't. So if you knew that you can go to your bank and, and be like, hey, man, I need like $50,000 because I want to go buy the, this dividend stock because I know I'm going to get like $1,000 a month for the rest of the year if I buy in this one stock. And they say, oh, yeah, we're just, we'll give it to you at 0.5% interest. You would be down at the bank getting that 0.5% interest. And you would have that loan. It's just paying it back over time with inflation costs more with the money that you're getting back. So it'd be no problem, right? So you don't have that luxury, whereas the big boys have that luxury. So what do they do? They get greedy. They start buying everything, even if it's not a sound investment. And when it's not a sound investment and the tide rolls out and there's a recession, all of a sudden that business goes bye-bye, but they still owe money for that loan. Now they have to sell their assets or figure out from their profits that they're going to have to pay what they borrowed. And now all of a sudden they're selling stocks, they're selling items that are, asset, are, are assets. And the next thing you know, who gets to pick those up for cheap? Us. So first, we're going to have the stock market. It's been on sale, but it's been on sale for the last eight, nine months. Housing, which is our mantra for 2024, buy a home in 2024 is next. So again, are you going to be patient? Are you going to be there when you're going to have a second bite at the apple to build wealth exponentially on two fronts? Not just one front, not just stocks, but a home that will appreciate so much faster in two or three years than your stock would. You would have to take, I'll give an example. Let's see what else. Mr. Financial has said IEP. That's right. That's the Carl Icon stock. I is in India. E is in Eric. P is in Paul. I mentioned it before. 17% return on your investment. It's a dividend investment, ladies and gentlemen. What is What is anybody sitting here waiting for? Get your behinds in these things. You are not going to be able to get 17, 18, 15, 14% returns when the economy gets hot. You're going to be sitting in the catbird seat. You're going to be sitting there saying, damn, man. I remember when Eric was telling me, get in these things at 17%, 14%, 18% at the end of 2023. And I did. And here it is, 2025. And I'm still getting this 17% on that money that I put in two years ago. Beautiful, right? That's what you want because you can build from there. But get this, if you're able to buy a home, if you're lucky enough to have bought a home prior to when the, the home prices went up 40% in two years, pre, so that means your interest rates are like probably under 4%. You're going to be loving life. Everybody who bought homes in 21, uh, 20, uh, 2020 at the end, 2021, at the beginning of 2022, you paid like 20 to 40 to 50 percent more. You're going to have a little problem. But for all of those people who bought prior to 2020. All those people who are going to buy next year after the stock or after the properties go down, can you imagine buying a home at 50 percent off of? January 2022 prices, and then waiting three years for the house to go up 20 to 50 percent. That's it. Three or four years. Where are you going to get this extra 100,000, 200,000 from? Thin air. You just had to buy the home. Then you get to sit back and let the Federal Reserve make you a millionaire. That's it. That's it. That's the playbook. They're going to reduce their interest rates in probably sometime, uh, probably, I'm thinking six, seven months. That'll be the first reduction. But meanwhile, that's not going to save people buying homes because the interest rate's still going to be like 7.5, 8.5%, somewhere in there, maybe higher. 
So they're not going to get saved. But if you get the home at 50 percent off and when they take two years to get their interest rate back under four percent, all of a sudden, all that appreciation when people out there buying homes again. You get to win by default because your home price is going to go up more than likely double. So you could have 200 if you bought a two hundred fifty thousand dollar house. You could have 200, 250, 300 thousand dollars in equity in three years. Where you're going to get two or three hundred thousand dollars in three years? Seriously. So there's another way to get your achieve your financial freedom in 2023. You have to make plans, ladies and gentlemen. That's what you do. You have to make plans. Victor, yes, buy while some stocks at lowest. J A G N C. Jeppy, that's J E P I, ladies and gentlemen. There goes another one. You want 11% return? Jeppy, J P Morgan. I call J P Morgan a Fed bank, Fed property. So therefore, that's pretty much safe. I'll take 11% on Jeppy, 11.5% on Jeppy all day, every day for the rest of my life. Because J P Morgan will not be going out of business. The only thing JP Morgan would be doing is merging, which they've already done, but they would be merging again when some other big time banking institution goes out of business and they either buy them out, form a partnership, but they'll just get bigger. They're not going anywhere. And if you can get 11, 12% return from JP Morgan funds, Jeppy's the one. Another one that we've been talking about. Thank you so much for bringing that up, Mr. Financial. That's powerful. Passive income through dividend stocks. Yes, it is. Agreed. Remember, Monday night, Vegas Home bought at 600K. Then 2021, Home gained equity 300K. Should they be upset? Exactly. Exactly not. But here's the question. Did they do the damn thing that they should have done? Were they trying to be financially free in the future because with $300,000 equity gain, how many people went out there and took out a hundred thousand, 150,000 and bought a second home or bought of a, uh, an asset, a business or something that's going to give them a return on that investment. Not just go out here and buy an RV or a boat or motorcycles or cars. Those don't give you returns. We're talking about you take the equity out and you could have, they could have taken a hundred thousand and bought a business that has revenue, profits coming in, 150,000, 200,000. You could have bought two, one business, one whatever other asset class you wanna buy, and you could have passive income coming in for the rest of your life because this is what you're supposed to use this 100,000 equity, 150, 200,000 equity, get multifamily homes, multifamily property, apartments, fourplex, twoplex. This way you know you have revenues coming in for life and you're using other people's money and you can pay back your loan. Simple, ladies and gentlemen. So that's how the rich do it. And they continue to build rich because if you have 5,000, 10,000, 15,000 a month coming in, that gives you the freedom to be able to buy things when the economy goes bad, but not that many people have that type of money coming in. So therefore, the people with the multi-million sitting on standby, they get to buy things at discounted prices and the wealth continues to get larger for them, smaller for us. But again, I've been on this crusade. We need more of us in the stock market. We don't want the 10 percenters owning 89 percent. We want 10 percenters owning like 75 percent if we could ever get down there. So get your investments into the equities. Get your homes as well when the homes are at 40, 50 percent off. Remember, go get your Zillow intact, your Redfin intact. Get everything intact. 1.5 million, 1.8 million foreclosures. Guess what? They just started, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, that adds to the downfall over the next seven, eight months. So check it out now. Let's see what else we got here. Let's go. Let's go. Remember Monday night. And then Mr. Financial, JP Morgan stock has regained ground from October low 103 to 132 this week. Exactly. That's what I'm talking about. So here we are, ladies and gentlemen. This is a beautiful, beautiful thing. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to do a little promo 
right here, right now. So check this out. But it would have been so awesome. I was going to soar right through here like this. And I, whoops, I'm sorry. Oh, Vin Diesel, excuse me. My bad, my bad. Big fan though, Mr. Diesel. Excuse me. And then I'm flying and I'd be flying and I'd land right. Where do I land? Oh, come on, come on. Ladies and gentlemen, 30 minutes in, please smash that like button. And if you like what we're talking about, please subscribe to the channel. Click the all notification bell. How to achieve financial freedom in 2023? Well, guess what? Everybody who's been here in the SSN Nation for the last four years, this is nothing new to them. We've been talking real estate. We've been talking stocks. We've been talking even crypto. But crypto has been a total disaster. Total disaster over the last year. It's incredible there is a time to get something in crypto and that's when it's backed by real world assets real world businesses crypto and they're backed by an nft licenses are backed by real businesses that have stores real businesses that employ people Real businesses that are in oil, gas, aluminums, satellite scanning systems, water under the ground, gold, silver, iron, all under the ground. Do you want a piece of that, ladies and gentlemen? Do you want to earn some of those profits from some of these companies that have stores in Cyprus, in France, in Spain, in the UK? Two separate companies, the two number one businesses of 2023, they're here. One is cash flow NFT. One is debt box node, which is a license. And all of it is passive income. Set it and forget it. Cash flow NFT is the most passive of all because there is no monthly payment. It's a one time investment into the NFT marketing club, the Boogie Gopher Club. And you don't have to do anything else. Sit back. They give you rewards from the stores, from the exchange, from all their six or seven business portals. And therefore, they split the profit. Some cases, most cases, 50-50. NFT holders can be getting thousands per month, every month while you sleep. No barriers to entry. The only barrier is you have to spend either $5,000 for the NFT or you can become a free affiliate with Cashflow NFT, which is Miracle Cash and more. You can go down there and get your set people up by referring 10 people. There's your five grand. If you don't have the five grand free affiliate program, refer 10 people, get $500. 10 times you do that. Not only do you get a $5,000 NFT or be able to buy one. You also are going to be in their global pool if you refer 10 people. How sweet is that? That is impressive in itself. And the global pool is expected to be around $2,000 to $3,000 per month. On top of if you're holding an NFT, you're going to get whatever that is monthly. So think about it. This could add up greatly. How would you like $20,000, $30,000, $40,000 annually passively? I do. I love it. That's Miracle Cash and more. The link is down below. Sign up for free or buy the 5,000 NFT. Below the Miracle Cash and more, you'll find our cash flow NFT $5,000 business opportunity. And you can put in as low as $250. Increments have to be $250, $500, $750, $1,000 but you can use your credit debit cards, checking account, or you can use your crypto USDT to get in on our SSN lifestyle, 
cash flow nft five thousand dollars how this works whatever percentage you put in that's what percentage you're going to receive monthly starting in march if you put in 500 you get 10 percent that means if they cut a check for twenty five hundred dollars you get 250. the following month if they cut a check for five grand you get 10 percent. that means you get 500. that's how it works it's that simple not that hard but we give you another way to get in with the sister property ssn lifestyle so check that out down below that's there for you all right so here we go we'll continue agree that's a stock you need to have in your portfolio especially with a little over three percent dividend exactly fed banks gotta love it um two years ago we told everybody to get some wells fargo when it was only 30 dollars i'm just saying <laughs> um sbf ftx the voyager the block by the crypto chaos exactly all going down because they were all backed by each other's bull can you believe this everybody was basically borrowing from everybody making deals with other risky businesses and so when one goes down nobody's there there is no central bank ftx was trying to be a central bank based on that fake ftt token that's what he was trying to do. It's incredible when you think about it. He tried, he almost pulled it off, but he was trying to be a Fed bank for crypto. That's why he said, I'm going to help you out, Voyager. I'm going to help you out, BlockFi. I'm going to help out everybody because he was getting that free money until he wasn't. And then when everything starts going down and they're making trades and using customer money, making trades and going downhill, all of a sudden they don't have the funds. They can't pay back the loans and they don't have the money so it was just inevitable for the big crash so again this brought down more than just one company this is why this is bad and this is why in crypto we're gonna have to go with things that are backed by real world assets we can't go with this guesswork anymore these tokens and all this stuff we got to put our monies into something that's bona fide licensed and regulated in the real world where we receive part of the profits debt box node is another one ladies and gentlemen this one's a little different because these are licenses they do mining your license does mining every day 24 hours a day seven days a week but it will cost you so you got to pay minimum like uh fifteen hundred dollars for the gold license dlg but you're gonna have to pay like 45 dollars per month for the mining is going to cost you well fifteen dollars a month is what it's going to cost you for the mining if you want to be a member of ix global where you can refer other people then you have to pay a minimum of 115 per month so that's what you have to keep in mind but the link is down below for ix global and you can find out by searching the channel debt box node i'm just going over this real briefly for you because this is another place Victor, I held. I have been looking for safe places plus dividends. Exactly. Exactly. There's a few YouTubers talking about commodity backed crypto like SSN family. Exactly. It's just a few people because, again, most people want to go with these tokens and these pump and dumps. That's literally what it seems that crypto has been. And I'm not going down that path any longer. So, no high risk, high rewards any longer. We're going with risk but no high risk anymore. So I won't be talking about the pump and dumps, the 3% per week, 1% per day. Won't be talking about any of that going forward because we can't take any high risk anymore. The economy's going down. Things aren't going according to plan for us, the OCs, the ordinary citizens. So I have to say it, think the crypto called black gold and natural gas back crypto. Haven't heard of them and I'm not looking for them because again, I know for a fact these guys over at Debtbox Node with their scanner system, they are able to detect platinum, rhodium, iron underground. So when you can do that, other exploration companies are going to rent you out, rent out your satellite time. That means profits are coming in from that. Then they can make partnerships with these same exploration companies or directly with the mine themselves. And now all of a sudden they're getting 4%, 5% of trillions of dollars. And part of that trillions of dollars comes into our pockets. I love it. So that's why I'm not backing off from 
the guys at Debt Box Node, IX Global. Anybody else coming up with something? Hey, there's going to be copycats, but I'm going with the guys that actually have one person on the planet that can do this. There are three people on the planet that can do it. The second ones were in the Ukraine. The guys from Ukraine, they haven't surfaced since the war. So therefore, there's two people now, two companies on the planet that have scanner technology that's worth anything. But number one, patent pending is debt box node. IX Global is the partnership where they can buy and allow us to buy these licenses for wholesale prices. So that's why I'm sticking with them. All right. Uh, SBF, he had to know this SHIT would hit the fan. Banks have failed. Who's he different? Exactly. He's not different. But here's the thing. Remember, he's a geek. And remember, he's privileged. His parents, apparently, professors um, at, at Stanford, at least one of them I know for sure. I don't know if both are. I know his dad is. And they were lawyers, apparently. One of them, anyhow. So he's been privileged. He went to MIT. Privilege. So basically, he could get away with almost anything. So he doesn't think anything is wrong. He's thinking everything he's doing. He's talking to Gensler. He's talking to the Congress. He's talking to the SEC. They're all giving, saying, okay. And he's connected. His family's connected with SEC individuals or former SEC individuals. So he's thinking I'm all good no matter what I'm doing. I'm telling you I'm doing it in broad daylight. You can track my crypto. You see what we're doing. You see I'm borrowing money from you. He's borrowing money from the government. He's borrowing money. I mean, so he's transparent. So when they said every year go by and he's doing stuff, he's thinking it's all good, just like anybody would. They didn't come get me. They haven't talked to me. They're acting like I'm their buddy. They want me to come in and go to Congress and say, how can we get crypto regulated? The top guys, Black Rock and uh, Sequoia Capital, they uh, invested in me. Clearly, they did their own due diligence. So I guess everything I'm doing is all good. So what would you do? You'd be rolling too. Nobody's blocking. Nobody's saying, hey, 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 something's wrong here. You shouldn't be doing this. So I'm just saying. So I can't blame him entirely because he's been privileged the whole time. But he knew he was doing wrong. But he sounded on TV like, oh, no, I didn't know anything about it. I was just doing it. I'm like, clearly, he can't be that stupid. And he's not. But his parents said, you better act stupid, <laughs> Curtis Davis. And when you talk ETF 500 index funds, oh, by the way, these are good. VOO, yes. VOOG, yes. You will find JPM inside the top 12 companies being invested in. Right up there with Apple, Amazon, Google. Exactly. I love that. Thank you so much for mentioning it, Victor Morrell. That's right. You guys know. Check them out. VOO, if you don't have your pen, pad, and paper ready, do you want to achieve financial freedom? This is all in the playbook. We're giving you four things that are in the playbook so far. Stocks, real estate, crypto plays that are backed by real world businesses, and then these index funds. Vanguard Group, one of the lowest expense funds out there. Check out discretionaries. Check out the VCR with Vanguard. F, uh, VT, SAX, look through some of their funds that you might find something you like. All right, go check them out because stocks have dropped. 70% of stocks have dropped. So when the economy goes back, imagine if you would have bought during this, this bear market and then all of a sudden, okay, I'm going to explain something the the dow jones we'll stay with the dow jones let's say it was 30 i think it was 38 or 39,000 it's down to about 33,000 32,000 right now all right that's nearly 30% off so whatever you put in right now imagine a 30% increase but just keep this in mind it's not actually the same percentage that has dropped as the stock. So, for instance, Tesla has dropped 70%, all right, just this year. It was, on the split, 
three hundred dollars. It now is one twelve. Now, what I'm getting at is this: even though they drop seventy percent, a seventy percent return doesn't have to. It doesn't go back to three hundred. Seventy percent return simply gets you. The stock goes up to one ninety, two hundred. That's 70% return on your money if it goes back to that number. So all I'm trying to show you is just because something drops 60, 70, 80, 100%, you don't need that 100% or 200% to gain back. All you need is 30%, 50%, 60%, and you're going to be very happy. So temper your thought process. You're not going to be thinking, hey, I'm going to buy something for 112 and it's going to be 400 next year. You shouldn't be thinking that. You should be thinking, okay, maybe it'll go back up to 150, 200 in six, seven, eight months. Maybe. Who knows? But it could also go back down as well, but unlikely. In a bull market, meaning going up. So you can position yourself because the thing could happen. Tesla's at 112. All of a sudden, you find out two years from now, it's 450. And you're sitting there thinking, damn, I could have bought that. I could have bought 10 shares for 1100 bucks. I'm just using that as an example. Now, all of a sudden, those 10 shares is worth 4500 5000 whatever the case may be. You're sitting there like, man, I could have made that four grand, three grand profit, 3500 four grand, just by buying it when it was low and taking a chance. That's your job, ladies and gentlemen taking a risk to earn money down the road all right i'm not sure sbf will get jail time the alameda ceo she's bogus no honor among thieves i don't think snitching going to save her but uh yeah i think snitching is going to save her i'm seeing some of these sentences being handed out to uh white collar guys and uh some of these plea bargains they're giving people these stupid ridiculous three month look the way the federal government works is very, very simple. You've never been in trouble before. You do things like, oh, we're going to give them six months jail time. What's going to end up happening? That could be the plea deal. But what's generally going to happen? They're going to come up with, oh, we'll give you three months ankle bracelet or six months ankle bracelet or or three months or six months pro, or six months probation. Well, I'll, I don't want to say six months probation, but, you know, two years probation some BS like that. As long as they keep it within like six year, six months and under, you can generally get out of any jail. So that's why she's going to snitch. Um, as long as SBF is sitting out here acting stupid, then uh, the CEO gets her, her information becomes more valuable. And uh, the other people that's going to be snitching, their information becomes more valuable. So we're going to find out how this is all going to turn out. But I have a feeling it's going to be a bunch of guys getting like six months, eight months. And people are going to be like, wait, isn't there federal guidelines in court? If you take X amount of hundreds of thousands or millions of dollars, you're supposed to get 20 years in jail. Funny how it never works out. Because think about this. Trump right now, $250 million dollars court case in New York. His accountant who oversaw everything, plea deal ends up being something stupid. Three months in jail, probation, pay a fine. What kind of $250 million fraud activity? And that's it? He's the guy writing the checks? He's the guy receiving benefits and not right putting it out on his taxes? And making sure the company doesn't have to pay taxes on it either. Straight up fraud activity. Three months. Crazy. This is what I'm talking about. Hey, facts. Tesla, Amazon, Google may not 10x, but they may rehype to 60%. This last nine months, a reset for all tech and some stocks. The Federal Reserve set the stock market. Exactly. They set the stock market. They set the home market. Housing market. All of that, you guys puts us in a position to take over. Well, some of the people that are watching the SSN Nation 
you guys are going to be taking over. You're going to be joining me in our own SSN Nation Club, right? So two years from now, I'll still be rocking on here. And then we're going to go have some fun, right? We're going to be doing remote locations. And then we'll be talking and talking big stuff going, hey, remember when we're getting our 17% return on our dividend stocks, 18% return. And look at the stock market. It's ro- risen. And now look at all them stocks that we could buy at pennies on the dollar. And now look at them, 100, 200% returns. And we're getting a little kickback from dividends. Oh, yeah, we're loving life. And oh, by the way, that crypto project we got into, the buyout's coming out in a year, two years, and we're getting that 2,000, 4,000, 5,000 a month checks. Beautiful work, ladies and gentlemen. Starting now. That's the funny thing. Some people say, hey, I, can, I don't understand. Where can I go to get my financial freedom? Actually, it's now. You don't have to go to the past. You can do it now. Get in while it's no barriers to entry. We're 52 minutes in. Please smash the like button and come back on Friday night at 9, 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time and join us. I don't know what the subject matter is going to be, but clearly it's the end of the year. So we have to set ourselves up for 2023. A lot of that is going to be some other platforms. I might as well talk about some other things, such as when you're doing anything, sometimes you may say, I don't have a skill to do something. Well, everybody has a skill, but why not piggyback something else to make money? So what I mean is everybody knows Airbnb, so I'll use Airbnb as an example. If you have a rental property that you can rent out with the laws in your city, state, county, and you can make money from Airbnb because you have an empty room or an empty apartment or whatever, why not use it? Whether you get the rental or not, it's not material. What it is, is you have an opportunity to use a platform and they, if somebody does reserve, you have additional revenue coming in. So you can use platforms. Yes, you can still use Amazon. Yes, you can still do a bunch of other things, right? You can still buy and sell on eBay. Here's a perfect thing right now. We're at the uh, clearance sales going on right now at stores. People are returning stuff. Items 60, 70, 80% off. You can actually go to the store on the clearance aisle, scan and look it up on Amazon or eBay and find out how much you can get it sold for. Simple maneuvering while you're out and about. You have ways to do it without you having to build a website, without you having to figure out a following, without you having to do anything. You could go to the store and just go down the clearance aisle and check this. How much is this? And you could possibly buy stuff for 30 bucks that's worth 130 bucks. And the next thing you know, you're there are like 10 of them sitting there. And you're sitting there like, wait a minute, if I did this, 30 bucks, 10 of them's 300. And now 10 of, if I sold all 10 of them, that's 1300. That's profits. But again, you have to spend a little money. And then some other people have said, and some other people, some other people have said, I'm going to use a cashback credit card. So not only do you have that discount for that, now you got your cashback credit card or your mileage credit card that you're using when you buy this stuff. So you're getting something off of your card and now you have a way to pay back your card and you have a way to be in business. Win, win. All right. So those are some of the ways that you can get your financial freedom because you can parlay it. So if you actually go on there and find out, hey, I can sell these things within a month or two. And then the next thing you know, you say, hey, wait a minute, I can actually do this with with anything, any time of the year. It's just that right now, though, there's plenty of clearance items until now, until the after the New Year's sales and all that. This is the sweet spot to get those items 20, 30, 60 percent, 80 percent off. And keep it going. You're in the wholesale type business. All right. It's rinse, repeat, get some cheap money, get some assets at like Airbnb property, crypto project, dividend stocks, this bottom floor opportunity, build a business today. He's done put it all out there, ladies and gentlemen. 
He's put it out there. Mr. Financial just said it. There it is. There it is. That's all you need to do right now. And buy a home 2024. That's the mantra. Or some of you may go, Eric, I already have a home. Fine. It may not apply to you. But if you can get a second home or anything in real estate, not anything, but a second home, uh, storage units, multifamily, duplex, I don't care what it is, as long as you can get some property, you're going to be sitting pretty three, four years from now. All right. Because there won't be any turning back. I don't believe. Once everything goes this time, this is going to be like Europe. It's going to be a problem. That's all I'm going to say. It's going to be a big problem. All right. Eric, where is the link for the ring of fire? Let's see. It's not down there. Uh, oh, it's not down there. Thank you for mentioning this. He's right. Miracle Cash and more and the IX Globals. The links aren't there. How could I? I blew that one. Yeah, it's not down there. Thank you for mentioning that because some people may have been looking for it and you're the first one that mentioned it. Some people may uh, not be able to be in the chat room because they don't have the icon. They're not members, so they weren't able to ask. So thank you for letting me know it wasn't in here. You refresh your page, ladies and gentlemen. It's in there now. IX Global is also not down there. Sheesh. That's the uh, debt box node. That's also a way to have passive income. That's what I mentioned earlier. So let me put that down there as well. Oh, I put everything else but that. Opus Virtual Office is there. Um, and also what's not there, Unstoppable Domains. Unstoppable Domains, ladies and gentlemen, is a crypto-based domain, dot .crypto, dot .zill, dot .888, dot .nft, dot .x, dot .wallet, dot .blockchain. What this means is you can give it like ericbird.crypto and tell somebody when they're sending you payment or crypto, you don't have to give them your alphanumeric code. That's what makes it so beautiful. I can just tell you, if you want to send me crypto, just send it to ericbird.crypto. Stopstrugglingnow.crypto. SSNlifestyle.crypto. Right? If I need you to send crypto, I could do it that way because I have those unstoppable domains. They're only 10, 20, 30 bucks, 40 bucks right now. So why not get them? And you never know what that can turn into because you can actually put a website on the domain. And here's one of the features of the domain that's major. I'm just now putting this in as well. So if you don't see it yet, you're going to have to refresh the page. But the beauty of it is you can build a website on it. It's on the blockchain and one-time payment. All right. That's all there is. One time payment. So that's what I want you to understand. It's not like dot com where you have to renew your domain every year, two years, whatever the case may be. This is a one time twenty dollars, one time ten dollars, one time forty dollars. No annual fees. And your website's on the blockchain. So unless the blockchain goes down, your website does not ever go down. That is freedom, ladies and gentlemen. So I just want to let you know, all right, that's the beauty of this. So again, one hour's in, smash the like button. If you like what we're talking about, please subscribe to the channel. Click the all notification bell. And down at the very bottom, please sign up with our social media, especially if you haven't signed up for the newsletter, because whenever I do live streams or drop videos, I generally send messages out because YouTube does not. So that's how you guys get information on the email list. I'll send it out saying, hey, there's a live stream coming or I dropped a video. So that way, you know, via email and you'll also know eventually via any of the social media outlets, whether that's Twitter, whether that's uh, Instagram, does not matter. It's Facebook. It could be any of them. They're down below at the very bottom. So please sign up for that. 
and let's go one hour in and we're not going to make it too long but here we go credit card clearance items sell wholesale product buy at the low sell it high get some points rewards arbitrage cash flow there we go again he set it out there perfectly arbitraging is what we're doing ladies and gentlemen you can do this on the spot you don't have to do anything it's beautiful all right just think about it just think about it all right let's see what else we got here victor morero Kathmandu Park will have resort rooms. Oh my, Universal Studios Orlando coming. Oh my, they're not going to, oh man, that, that's pretty smart. That's pretty smart by them. Thank you for letting us know because again, no barriers to entry. You want real estate? No credit check, no qualifying, no barriers to entry with pre-construction properties. All right, pre-construction, ladies and gentlemen. Is that sweet or what? So I'm going to play something and I'll be right back. Here's Katmandu Park so everybody will understand what this is. Rising up from the shores of the is. Caribbean emerges a destination unlike any other. Set to open in spring of 2021, Katmandu Punta Cana will simply be the most fun imaginable. Here, visitors will discover an entertainment, dining and shopping destination erupting with vibrant colors, lively music and incredible diversions. From the second you step inside Kathmandu Punta Cana, you'll know you've discovered an amazing place filled with wonder, myth and adventure. In the Mythica Quest, you'll wander through unexpected worlds filled bottom to top with a myriad of wondrous and unexpected experiences. Climb aboard Odyssey to Catopia, the world's first suspended theater attraction, where you'll take a thrilling voyage to an underwater metropolis in peril. Then, in Legend of the Desirata, Embark on a remarkable journey through time in our state-of-the-art 4D dark ride attraction. A collection of additional world-class attractions steeped in magnificently original Kathmandu stories await. You'll also experience themed dining, a host of nighttime entertainment spots and shopping options to complete a full day of wonder, thrills and unforgettable memories. Kathmandu Punta Cana will welcome visitors from all over the world to explore an unbelievable entertainment spectacle where the party never stops. That's Kathmandu Park, ladies and gentlemen, in Dominican Republic. It's coming. And Victor Marrero says... Did you know Kathmandu Park and Punta Cana would also offer resort rooms inside Malia Hotel? I did not know that. Just like Universal Studios, there we go. That's why Malia took them guys in. I love it. Great business model. Beautiful business model, a la Disney, a la Universal. Exactly. I love it. They know what time it is. There's going to be so many millions of people coming. They're like, well, let me get some piece of the rooms. I can't blame them. Malia's all-inclusive, so I guess they'll have another. I can't imagine they'd be all-inclusive. Maybe they'll offer all-inclusive or just normal uh, room rates, but that's something that adds to the feature of the Punta Cana region for Kathmandu Parks. That's pretty sweet. So uh, I love it. Thank you for letting us know about this. I did not know that. That's interesting because they're thinking the same way I'm thinking. I'm thinking 8 million visitors next year in 2023. I'm thinking 9, 10 million in 2024. They know there's going to be 5 million potentially in 20, less than a year, 2024. 5 million people coming to Punta Cana only, 10 million to the island. That is significant, big time. That would be 100,000 people every week on average going to be in Punta Cana area. So they know already the numbers. They know there's not going to be enough rooms, not until they get to Laramar City and cruise on land. Vista Cana is not going to be big enough either. They know 
when Laramar City comes now, that's going to present what 30,000 potential rooms. And but that's 2026, 2027. Um, so 20,000 rentals there, but that only breaks down when you put in 52 weeks, that's only 4,000 rooms potentially, but not everybody's going to rent. So again, they know what's coming. They're preparing for the future. I love it. This is how you have to think, ladies and gentlemen, prepare yourself for the future. This is what we're trying to do here. All right. So how to achieve financial freedom 2023. We talked about the arbitrage method. We talked about the clearance item method. There's different ways to do it. And now is the time. And this could all start now. We don't, you don't need any, any real knowledge. All of this you can do. Nobody's stopping you. You just stopping yourself if you don't want to do it. Or sometimes it might be financially you can't do it. But nonetheless, you got to do something because you're going to be left behind. When 2025 rolls around and home prices are a million dollars, 800,000, 600,000, and you need to have household income of 200 Gs, that eliminates millions of people. $200,000, $300,000 homes, $700,000, $600,000, $800,000 in 2025 because the Federal Reserve is going to reduce interest rates. By that time, it'll be under 4%. Probably, right, 3.5, somewhere in there. So I'm just saying, ladies and gentlemen, put yourself in position. You can do this. All right. I didn't plan on being on too long tonight. Um, remember, bring your glasses on Friday because it's 12, it's December 30th. So we're not going to have our 31st party, but I'll have the pre-party on the 30th. So I'll have my champagne glass all ready to go. All right. So let's have a little fun on Friday night. We'll be talking about making some more money. That's what we're going to be doing for 2023 because the wealth is going to be built in 2023, even from scratch. Some of you right now are going, Eric, I can only put in a little bit. That's all it's going to take. The stock market's going to come back booming when they're going to start letting these guys borrow at low interest rates. That'll be again a year from now. It'll be on. But stock market's going to rise because the top 10 percenters don't lose. They always manipulate. They're not going to lose. So be prepared, ladies and gentlemen. All right. If anybody wants to talk about anything, I'm going to make this short tonight. One hour, eight minutes in. Again, down below in the description, go peruse that, please. All kind of opportunities. Free stocks from Robin Hood and Weeble. If you want to get your Opus virtual office, if you're thinking about starting an LLC, get your virtual office, not your home address. The government, IRS, they're going to start being sticklers when people are actually co-mingling. And what I mean is you work out of your home and then you try to use part of your home as a deduction. And then they say, well, wait a minute. How's this guy trying to take $12,000 off every year? And then they say, well, OK, that's not going to work for us. Because unless he's using X amount of square feet, and most people they know, most people have like a 2,000 square foot house. So is he trying to tell us he has a 1,000 square foot office? Because most people will not have a 1,000 square foot office. So therefore, how's he taking off $1,000 per month? I think we need to audit this person. And then they find out your office is 10 by 10. And they're like, wait. Um, how much do you pay here? 2,000. 10 by 10 is 100 feet. Oh, I'm sorry. You can only take out $100, deduct $100. So now you got to pay tax. So all I'm saying is you got to do it properly. So if you're going to say I have a business, virtual office works for me, and I'm still going to be getting my 100 square feet off of my house for at my house, but at least it's separate. It's not commingled. That's all I'm trying to illustrate here with the benefits of business credit. So if you want to get business credit, search the uh, channel for business credit. All right. If there's anything else anybody wants to talk about, please let me know. Because tonight I wasn't going to be on here long because I realized I was like, wait a minute. I've been doing two hour videos, two and a half hour videos, giving out stories. Then it ends up being three hours. All right. We're going to have to start shutting it down. Because 
time is going to become more valuable for me in 2023 because now we're back into some things that I want to do. So again, I've got to get the SSN lifestyle going because we have, we have awesome, awesome health products that's not really out there that much. So we're going to have to start marketing that a little bit more for the SSN lifestyle crowd. We haven't been marketing where people could actually be going on. Anybody want to go to Las Vegas three nights for New Year's? Saying it might be risky the way they're canceling flights these days. But nonetheless, these type of things are going to come up more more often with SSN Lifestyle. So you can actually make money, ladies and gentlemen. Another way to make money, SSN Lifestyle, which a lot, you can be a free affiliate there. And we have products and services that you can earn residual or passive income. That's not bad, I would think. Several different ways. Um, yeah, I don't have that link tonight, but it's okay. I'm just letting you guys get heads up because we're going to go heavy into what we've been pretty much talking about the latter half of this year except we're going to get a little more heavier into it. I have it planned out where we're probably going to, I'm going to talk specifically like cash flow NFT on live streams and actually do the PDF. So then people can ask questions. I'm going to start doing debt box nodes also on the live. So Monday, Wednesday, Friday, maybe I'll do a Tuesday as well. Get a little more involved because these are products that ordinary citizens can use passive income. We got a chance, ladies and gentlemen, and they don't come along too often. All right. The biz fund groups are offering 100K with 116K payback and up to 1 mil funds. All right. That's interesting. <laughs> All right. 16% uh, on 100K. Okay. Uh, that's not too bad if it's, well, depends on the time frame. Are we talking about one year, three months, two years, three years? That's the interesting thing. Okay, I see how they're going to do it. Um, yeah, that's that's interesting right there. Very, very interesting. Thanks for that, Curtis Davis, Mr. Financial. Appreciate it. All right, hopefully everybody had a wonderful, wonderful Christmas time. Happy holidays are going on, getting ready for the new year. All I'm doing is preparing for the carnage that I'm trying to handle in 2023. Because this is the final frontier as far as I'm concerned. All right. What is this? No terms. No, the terms are six years up to 10 years. Well, then what, what are you saying? 100K, no terms, six years. All right. Well, I like, the, I like it then if we have six or 10 year terms. I love it. Buy a real gift for family. Assets, stocks. Hey, there you go. There we go. I like that sound. I like the way that sounds. That's it exactly, ladies and gentlemen. That's what we want. So again, if anybody has anything that they would like to talk about tonight, please present it. But I realize if you're watching this and you can't get in the chat room, there's a reason. Wednesday nights are specifically for members only with the icon they're the only ones that can be in the chat room. On Monday and Friday, everybody can be in the chat room. But on Wednesday, in order to get in the chat room, you got to be a member of the channel. Like Victor Marrero here that has the icon next to his name. And he says, Malia Hotel and Resort aren't stupid. You got that right. They know they can sell their rooms and offer park tickets. Exactly. Those projects that are closed by will benefit from the overflow. Exactly. Exactly right. 100%. Yes, the loans are six years to 10 year terms, 3% some cases. Well, Curtis Davis, this is something that you should be sharing with the group here. I love it. 3% is awesome. This is what the big boys get. What is the catch? That is the question. What is the catch? Do we have to have revenue numbers? Do you have to have a business? How long? How old? Those are the catches right there. Um. So.
Well, it looks like we have something to talk about here. That loan situation, 3% loan, six year, 10 years, that's beautiful. This is what the big boys get. Well, they get better terms than that. <laughs> 2%, 1%, 0.5. But all I'm saying, if they're giving 3% loans right now, that's a deal. Now, Curtis Davis, I don't want to hear. Yeah, okay, the catch is the revenues. So if they're going to use revenues, then that means they're going to use, um, there might be doing your credit. There might be a credit situation that might mean 100,000, 200,000, 300,000. And that also usually means you're going to have to be in business a certain amount of time. They're not going to let you make $20,000 this month, two or three months in a row and give you a hundred and thousand dollars they're going to be like okay he's got to be in business longer than that we don't have a track record so i don't i don't know what it's the track records are but hey curtis davis send me some email on this information let me know because that's very valuable for some people just like when we talk about um on deck and you know what's funny i saw an on deck commercial ladies and gentlemen we've been talking about on deck for two three years on deck is where you can get funding if you have ten thousand dollars per month revenues coming in not profit revenues and you have a 600 and i think they raised it to 640 credit score and you're in business one year you can get loans at on deck i couldn't believe it i started laughing i was like okay these guys are actually out here now trying to get some customers be aggressive i love it it's beautiful all right so Curtis Davis, please send that information to me. We'll talk about it on Friday night. And actually, I might even make a separate video about it, but we'll talk about it on Friday night as well when everybody will be in the chat room. But I appreciate you giving out that info if they're different companies than the ones we talked about before. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that's going to wrap it up for tonight. I know it's short. I know it's sweet, but... That's just the way it's going to be during the holiday times. But we'll be back on Friday getting ready for the 31st, but it's only going to be the 30th. So hopefully you'll join us at 9, 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on Friday. And we'll get into some more items. Oh, stock wise, G is in George, N is in Nancy, L. There goes another dividend stock, ladies and gentlemen. Check that one out. All right. So there you go. Thank you, Mr. Financial. Appreciate it. And go check out Chili Davis's channel. That is Curtis Davis here. Chili with two L's. Search the channels. Search the YouTubes. You'll find them in the YouTube streets. All right. Let's do this. We got to check out now, ladies and gentlemen. I'm out, so we got to go. But please like, subscribe, and click the bell below so you get the latest updates. And I know it's hard out here. And that's why we're preparing for 2023. Anybody can prepare. We can all start right now. Tomorrow, you can do everything that I mentioned in this video and just keep going. And you'll thank yourself later in a year and a half, two years from now. That's all I can tell you. And as you know, do your own due diligence. Go study what you need to study. Feel comfortable with any investment and then decide if it's for you. And with all that said, ladies and gentlemen, keep your head up, keep moving, and I'm out.